All right, guys, here we go. Looking at the five minute chart, as you can see, uh, PTON uh, uh, Peloton Interactive is blowing up today. Uh, actually, going into all time highs, okay. And also, we broke up and out of this uh, long term uptrend line, and then uh, we're very extended above the 20s. So, what we're saying is we're getting ready to take a short position. 1,000 shares on, on margin. We'll just do a market sell up here and then hopefully buy back, you know, uh, at this 20. And we haven't hit the 20 since, uh, well, uh, early this morning right after trading day started. So we're looking to, if we take this candle out that we're on now, or even if we don't, we like we close right here, we still have over two minutes left. Uh, even if we uh, keep moving up into I'm thinking uh, well uh, 103 or whatever uh, we'll keep uh, raising this uh, blue dash line up and we're just looking for a rollover through those uh, when a price breaks up and out of a trend line it'll always come back and retest it uh, it was resistance through here and then price will come back and test it to see if that resistance still I mean, see if it's now support, sorry. Old resistance then becomes support, but uh, if we break through it, which I'm thinking we will, since it's just on the five minute chart, uh, we'll come down and test that 20. So looking to you know catch that opportunity. I have uh, less than two minutes left on this candle right now. So uh, we'll put you on pause, and then when the price action picks up, either to the upside, then we'll keep raising it up you know, our entry level, or if it rolls over, we'll go ahead and catch it then. Okay, guys, we're pushing up a little bit. Just wanted to uh, touch base. Uh, 102.79, uh, getting close to 103. So we hit 103, we will definitely take that short position there. Uh, let me see. Up there, or uh that's where i prefer to take it but if we roll over on this candle here we got to be rather ready either way and uh yeah we'll be ready uh but we won't i'd rather take this option because it's higher at 103 obviously it gets the odds in our favor a little bit better and uh, uh we'll go from there because we will pull back and and re uh test this line you know previous resistance maybe that next time it holds it um, price action will be hoping for a, a support but I'm thinking we'll probably roll through it into this 20 wherever that is at that time because we you know the 20 keeps moving up as price moves up so we'll have to see so all right uh, let's just hold here and see where we go okay guys here we go uh, we're going to be in here any second if we cross through there. Um, we're a couple of cents away. If we flip, in other words, the 50's on top, and this is like 49, 48, then we'll, we'll be in. Um, what was the low on this candle? 102.45. Uh, we popped up. That's okay. Up to 10 cents higher. Okay, I thought we were on to something, but we still have three more minutes to go, so anything can happen. That's a world of time. So we'll put you on pause and come back. Okay, guys, we'll get, uh, we went through it. I didn't have the recording on, so I didn't take the position because I want everything on tape, on recorded. So we'll see if we can get a little pump to the upside real quick. But you know what, I'm not going to risk Let's just go ahead and take it here. Uh, it's a little bit lower than where we wanted it. And we just did a uh, market uh, sale here. There's only like a penny or so difference between the bid and the ask, so we're not going to get too hurt. Um, but anyway, we'll uh, still have another minute to go. And see, I'd like for it to have gone up to that 102. I mean, 103 even, but we'll see if we can't get a little pullback here and uh, get the party started. 
Okay, got another minute, so let's put it on pause and we'll pick it up. Uh, this video is already getting kind of long. Okay, guys, we're back. This candle just closed just under where we got in at uh, about 10 cents difference. So we'll see kind of a pause now. Okay, the new candle just opened. We'll see if we'll get a, what I'm looking for, maybe a green candle here, a pause candle. And then a, then the next candle will be a, a bigger red candle to the downside. If we can hold in that area. And then like this candle will close uh, green and then a, a red candle to the downside of the next one. We'll see. Uh, maybe come back up, retest uh, this trend line, then roll over. But okay, uh, let me put you on pause again and we will pick up the action. Okay guys, we're back. Uh, the candle we got in on is right here. Let me take that one off. And uh, put in a second red candle. Now we're uh, gapped up a little bit uh, on this candle right here. But also we were looking and there hasn't been two, can two red candles in a row in quite a while. Not till uh, back here, you know, a few hours, ago, well, a couple hours ago or so. Uh, so that was unusual. Generally you get, uh, you know, two two red candles in a row or two green, you know, if you're going to the downside uh, more consistently than that. So we we're looking for uh, more red candles. So here we go, starting the next four hour, I mean four hour, <laughs> the next, so so used to talking about cryptos. Anyway, the next four minute, a uh, five minute candle, got four minutes on it uh, left now. So let me put you on pause and we'll come back. All right, guys, here we go. We're back. <clears throat> We're pushing down into that 20. Uh, let me put a line there. This is where we're going to try to take, uh, hopefully get another little push into here um, and run with it from there. Let's see. You got about four, three, two, one. Uh, now we'll start a new candle. Let's see if we can't tag this 20. That red line. Okay, we're out. We're just going to get out here. We're out and we're out. out. We bought back. Okay, guys. Uh, thanks for playing along. <laughs> Man, that took forever playing these five-minute candles. I just wanted to show where you could still slow the price action down. Uh, get in on these, you know, five-minute candles and still uh, make a little bit of change. And uh, run with, let's go to the two minute and see this is the same deal. That blue dash line is where we took uh, our short position and kind of lines up about right. You know, this long term uptrend line, we were trying to wait until we retested it. And then when we went through it, take that position there. And then uh, see how we hit the 20 on the two minute, kind of held here for uh, four minutes and then gapped lower. And this kind of where we are now, we're just uh, making a little automatic push back, and then we'll probably roll back over. Let's see what it looks like on the five minute. Yeah, it's just bouncing off that 20, uh, thinking it would would have done that. But if it, it starts closing, we'll come back and look at this. But if it starts closing under the 20, then uh, there's a lot of profit taken. This thing will melt to the downside. But in the meantime, thank you so much for being members and thank you so much for playing along and we will see you on the charts.